Well, after canceling their annual fireworks due to the lack of funding, one Elk County community is in for quite the surprise. The city of St. Mary's 4th of July fireworks are officially back on thanks to one local business who stepped up and saved the day. Ariani Tregellis was there when the Chamber of Commerce received that donation, and he joins us live now from St. Mary's. So, Yanni, who gave the donation, and what did it take to get this show back on? Maggie, it took an $11,000 donation from Graph Tech International. That is a global company located here in St. Mary's, and their generous donation really took everyone by surprise. They're making a substantial investment in our community, so um, we were very happy to be the recipient of their enormous generosity. The chamber had already started planning for the future. After only raising $500 of a $15,000 goal, they took over the concession stand at the local Benzinger Park and scheduling concerts throughout the summer. The proceeds of which will go to next year's fireworks. So we had been progressing on that line. Which is why... We're happily surprised to be contacted yesterday by Graph Tech International. The international graphite manufacturer donating $11,000 to the chamber. That along with the money the chamber had previously raised and now contributing their recent fundraising efforts has put them over the top. I mean, they're just, there's nowhere else like St. Mary's. It's just the best place to live and work. Um, and having events like this just elucidate that. Heavily involved in the community, Graph Tech offers scholarships to area high schoolers each year. And with many employees living in the area, the decision to help out was an easy one. I'm trying to look for ways to show our community involvement. We're investing a lot of money into Graph Tech right now, creating jobs for the community, and we saw this as a way to really give back and let people know that we're still here, we're excited. That the fireworks display meets the expectations of the citizens in the community. We're glad to do our part to make it happen. So the fireworks are going to take place on July 2nd at the St. Mary's Area High School. And just a few people that I've talked to as passing by, telling them the news that they are back on, they are extremely excited to have these fireworks back. In St. Mary's, Yanni Tregellis, WTAJ News. Certainly a really exciting time for St. Mary's. Yanni, thank you. This is all